It was a beautiful morning in the woods. Mama Bear had woken up early to make breakfast for her family. She decided to make porridge when she was done cooking. She poured each porridge out in three different bowls and each one different temperature according to each bear. When she served the porridge on the table, it was too hot, so they decided to go for a walk until the food cooled down. They got their stuff ready and left, but when they did not notice was that they left the door open. There in the woods was a little girl named Goldilocks. She was tired and hungry from walking so much. Suddenly she saw the house, so she decided to sit outside. But the delicious smell of the porridge brought her inside. She knocked on the door and she said, Is anybody there? But nobody answered, so she went inside and closed the door. There she saw that three bowls of porridge. She was so hungry, so she decided to try some porridge. She tried Papa Bear's, but it was too hot. Then she decided to try some of Mama Bear's porridge, but it was too gooey. She decided to try Little Bear's, and it was just right. It was perfect. So she decided to drink the porridge. She liked it very much, so she drank and drank, and she did not even notice that she had finished all Little Bear's porridge. She was still tired. She sat down in Papa Bear's chair, but it was too big. Then she tried Little Bear's chair, and it was perfect, so she started walking on the chair, but she broke it because it was too heavy. She was still tired, so she decided to go find a bed to rest in. When she walked into the room, she saw three beds and hopped around each one until she found the correct one. So she fell asleep in Little Bear's bed. Meanwhile, the bears had just arrived from their trip. As they walked inside, they had found out that somebody had broken in their house. They were very scared and they did not know what to do, especially Little Bear. Then he suddenly saw his chair. His favorite chair had been broken. He started sobbing. When they walked inside of the kitchen, they saw that their porridge had been drank out of. They pondered and pondered and they did not know what was wrong. So they suddenly heard a loud yawn. So they decided to go upstairs in the bedroom and then laying down, sleeping in comfortably in Little Bear's bed, they suddenly found Goldilocks. She was sleeping. She screamed her lungs out because she was very scared when they woke her up. They asked her why was she there and how come she had fallen asleep, had broken a chair and eaten some of their porridge. She felt very sorry and felt very sad. So she apologized and told them that it wasn't her intention to do that. She was just very tired and she was hungry too. So she apologized and the bears forgave her and they wished her a happy long way home and they said goodbye to Goldilocks.